Now then we're going to take this white dough and put it in the tub and then add chopped olives to it plus olive oil. So we begin by putting into the bottom of the plastic tub the olive oil. Put it right on top of the olives and oil. Now this is the best way to incorporate things like the chopped olives. Push down from the top and make the dough settle down on the oil and the chopped up olives. Then we are going to roll it up in the Swiss roll manner. I've rolled it up into a Swiss roll, I turn it through 90 degrees making sure that the ragged seam is upwards, then I roll it up again. Turn it over through the 90 degrees, seam up, gather the olives and roll again. Now on we go doing the same process. Now you don't want to drive it and push it so hard that you tear the dough completely. A little bit of tearing is normal. That you don't want to shred the dough. Don't be so forceful that you shred the dough. So just roll it up and then turn it through the 90 degrees, fold it over so that the ragged seam is up and do it again. Now that would have been about six times. Now, this is the last roll up and I'm going to give it a little rest. I've given it a short rest, now I'm going to finish the job inside the tub. A few more roll-ups till we've gathered in all the oil, just a slow steady process to gather in all the oil and the little chips of olive. A few more roll-ups and then the job will be done, we will have absorbed all the oil. Now I'm going to put it on the bench and speak about the actual process of rolling up in the Swiss roll style, it's important to use the thumbs as part of the process. So you don't drive hard with the thumbs because that might tear the dough and fracture the dough, but I use the thumbs constantly and I go forward with the thumbs, relax the thumbs and then roll. So it's a jerky action where I am active with the thumbs. This is how you do these roll-ups. Gathering in the spilt olives. There, job done. Back to the tub. Rolling up the dough inside a tub to incorporate oil is a very good way to work. I use the same method when I'm making focaccia. You take a piece of common white dough off a dough that you've already made that day into the tub with a generous amount of olive oil and the constant rolling up the Swiss roll. Turn, roll up, incorporating the oil like that enhances the dough. The gluten is actually lubricated by late addition of oil. It improves the performance of the gluten and makes a bulky, springy dough that is very satisfactory. So I recommend this way of putting oil into the dough.